hi guys and welcome back to my channel today i'm going to be bringing you guys my july boxycharm unboxing so let's get right into the video if you're not sure what boxycharm is be sure to check out my link i'm going to link it right here on the screen and that will be me showing my first boxycharm video and you'll be able to hear all about what boxycharm is so let's get right into july's box all right, so when you open the box, it looks just like this. This month's theme is the Boxy All Natural. So it looks like this, and all of them will be coming with a card. So just always know your Boxy Charm is going to come with a card outlining everything that you have in the box. Also, they sent us a $10 off at the Ulta Skin Bar. So it's like a coupon um, in collaboration with the first product that's in the box, which is this. Elemis or I think it's Elemis or Elemis. I'm not really sure how you pronounce this brand because I've never heard of it, but it's Elemis Superfood Vital Veggie Mask. Just read a little bit about this mask. It says, get a shot of green goodness with this treatment mask that nourishes, smooths, and brightens for softer, smoother, more radiant skin. So those are all the things we want with our skin, right? And it, it does smell green real green it smells like a green smoothie or something like spinach kale something i don't know but this will be good because i have really been loving getting skincare from boxy charm so that product is 35 dollars retail value the next thing i have here are these brushes these are by luxie and these are a three-piece brush set so the packaging looks like this so here are the three brushes that come in the pack they look just like this and they are really pretty pink wooden color so you get a foundation brush a large eye blending brush and a precision precision crease brush these are really nice brushes i hear good stuff about luxury brushes but i have never owned them so it's cool to get this little three-piece set all right so we're opening up to some of the good stuff here i'm going to pull out this liquid lipstick by ofra and this is in santorini that's the color all right so this is the ofra liquid lipstick right here um this looks really good um i like it i think that it is a pretty color it's really pink and it has like a shimmer to it i usually don't go for shimmery colors like this um i usually go for more like opaque matte colors but i'm gonna test it out anyway and it is a matte a matte liquid lipstick so that's a good thing although it has a shine it's still gonna dry um matte so this is what that look like so this is gonna be nice i think that that's a good addition to add to my makeup collection all right, so the next thing that I pull out is this gel liner in deep taupe. So it's just like a brown gel liner. Let me swatch this. All right, y'all, so that's the swatch right here of the Appeal Deep Taupe Gel Liner. That's a really nice color. Um, I usually wouldn't use brown, but I'm gonna probably test this out and see how I like it. But this is by Appeal, and that is $21. I always do this in all my boxy charms. I forget to tell y'all the price. The gel liner is $21 retail value. The Ofra liquid lipstick is $20 retail value. And this Luxie three-piece set is $30 retail value. Also, the last thing and the best thing, in my opinion, this is what I was the most excited about, is this Butter London eyeshadow palette. So here it is. Butter London eyeshadow palette, pretty packaging, and the name of this is Natural Goddess. So, you know, we're trying to be natural goddesses all summer long, and these are the colors. I'm really excited to try out some of these um, natural tones because they're really earthy, like real all natural, goes perfect with the theme. So I want to play with some of the colors. So first I'm gonna take this shade right here in the color Temptress. I'm gonna lightly dust that in my crease. And then we're gonna take this color in Diva, which is a gold shimmery color. Blow a little bit of the fallout out. And we're going to 
apply that um into the like the crease part okay okay do you this brush is really nice y'all this is a good precision crease brush works real good to get right in there where you want to be so it has the perfect name it's called a precision crease and that's exactly what it's good for if you want to carve out your crease for like a cut crease this is the brush you would want to use so i'm going to go back in with that brown and like tidy up the lines there a little bit and this is more of a natural look i'm going for right now so i'm kind of patting it in and then doing my windshield wiper motions to blend that out i'm just filling through filling through the process and so i'm gonna go in with the blue i'm gonna go ahead and be a little bold and i'm gonna take the blue right under my eye We're gonna deepen this up a little bit more with this brown gel liner. So we're gonna go in our waterline with it. But this gel liner is really creamy. Like you don't have to do too much with that. Ooh, okay. So perfect. This is the eyeshadow look I came up with for this palette. Looks really natural. I didn't reapply any mascara or anything. I already had mascara on from earlier. I'm feeling all earthy and everything, you know what I'm saying? So this is the end of my BoxyCharm video, y'all. I just really came on here to do a quick one. I know somebody might care, may not, but this is the lip combo I got on today. I got on my Dominique Cosmetics um, Peach Tea Lemonade lipstick and then I have on the Fenty Beauty Fenty Glow on top that's it but y'all I really like this eyeshadow look I think it's really cute or whatever you know what I'm saying it was real like I ain't trying but I'm trying it's real cute and I honestly really like this brown and then the blue pretty much the three colors that I use are these last three so this this palette is really cool like you can make good looks with this palette and everything but y'all if y'all like these boxy charm videos make sure to give this video a thumbs up so that i know you like them and i will see you guys in my next video